talent, where does it come from? Do we inherit it from our parents? But what if your parents are talented in two completely different ways? How will that affect you? I inherited the, his gene or his savviness for computers, and I, I've been messing with technology ever since I was a toddler. James Overton is a computer science major who believes he got his computer savviness. My dad's a computer science major. From his father. He's computer whiz. I was a computer whiz. I was the kid that used to get out of class in first grade. People would call me through the intercom in my Catholic, Catholic school that I attended, and they would ask me to go around and fix fix random technology, like random things like computers or TVs, like, oh, can we get James to come down here and fix the computer for us? James has high aspirations as to what he wants to do with his major. When I think of computer forensics, I think of something like James Bond, like I already have the first name down anyway, so I was like, I could just change my name to Bond, you know? Um, but I was thinking that me being part of the CIA, me being I, I, my, when I thought about it, I thought about like becoming a hacker, and I thought that would be like absolutely amazing. Like I'll be the guy to hunt people down through the interweb or the, the internet, and I will be also be the guy to physically hunt them down. So I think I was like, it sounds a little like a, a childhood dream, but it sounds it's really it sounds really cool to me. And I like to live life a little bit on the edge. I like to keep things interesting. But his ambitions don't end with James Bond because he also has a talent and passion. For music. Though I try to resist, I still want it all. Every time I play or I sing, play the piano or I sing or I perform, I, I let out a part of me that I don't really get to let out often. It's a part of me that becomes enveloped in that music. It becomes a part of that music. And there's no feeling quite like that for me. What James got from his dad in technology, he got from his mother in music. What I was getting from my dad in the technological aspect, I was getting from my mom in the musical aspect. So I was, at the same time, I was running around touching and playing around with technology. I was sitting there and I was singing with my mom. In a way, James has the best of both worlds. For him, I think it's cool that he can go down the career path with computer science. But, I mean, when you're an artist, you're always an artist. It's not something that just goes away. So, I mean, I hope to see him on the weekends doing gigs and, like, just pursuing his dream because I think singing is really important. Playing is just a really good outlet for artistic expression. So, I hope to see him do both and not just, you know, focus on one because, I mean, why put yourself inside a box, so. I think I'm very, very fortunate to have two things that I'm passionate about. Computers, computers are my, is my life, but even more so music. So it's the fact that I have those two in my life and I exercise and I, I pay certain very, very close attention or I pay, give them the attention that they both need in my life, those two passions, I'm satisfied, I'm happy. I don't have any quarrels with my life at this point. With passion and talent on his side, it doesn't matter what James decides to do, because he has. Get the best of both worlds. <laughs> Kevin Mendez, UTA News. James is optimistic that one day he'll be able to incorporate both of his passions into one.